I've just gotten out of class. This is like super crooked. Um, it was my mafia class. It went really well. I had I got two packages um, because I ordered a charger and I ordered two flash drives, but I don't know what, pack what is in these packages. Now I'm going to the little um, shop, if I can remember which how to get there. So the little shop that, um, the photocopy shop that has like all the readers and like notebooks and all that stuff. So we'll see. And then I have to pick up some other stuff like scrunchies, clips for my hair, makeup remover. So like eye makeup remover, I desperately need that. But yeah, hopefully I can find this place. I don't remember where to go now that I'm here. Ah. with the copy guy uh, the guy who did the the books for me don't know why it's not focused at anything um I, I when i came last time he, he we spoke a little and he was like oh you speak really well whatever and this time i guess he forgot and then he was like oh you speak really well i was like yeah that's what you told me last time i was here he was like oh you're right you're a familiar face just you know you haven't come um like often enough for me to remember you and I'm like, no, of course, I understand. He's like, come more often. He recommended some restaurants to me and he told me that there's a good restaurant down that way. Um, oh God, this hill. That he says that if I tell him, if I tell the restaurant people that he sent me, um, they would give me a discount. <laughs> so we'll see, but either way, it's a cool, it's a cool experience. Um, yeah. I don't know if, 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 um, if I will put this into the video or if I will incorporate it. I'm not gonna sit here and say all the details about what I'm going through. Um, but I do think that it's important for my own um, healing and my own well-being to document the ugly parts of, um, of just life. And right now is one of those parts and I'm really trying to be strong <laughs> but I think it's okay to be weak sometimes to go through through what I'm going through and, and and you never expect anything in life you don't expect the beautiful moments and you don't expect the terrible moments or or the bad moments and um so I'm um, I'm I'm thankful for this experience but I've said in the past that you need to learn to be patient with yourself and I'm and I'm learning what that means and this is one of those moments where I feel like I'm not being patient with myself because I, I want to be better already and and every time I think I'm doing better something brings me back and it's really hard to accept it's just really hard to accept um, what I'm going through and maybe it's not the worst thing on the planet but for right now this is my worst thing and it's still valid I'm thankful that um, I right now have plans with some people um, because I have to go out taking to take pictures for my photography class and I've already taken some, but not nearly as enough as I, I'm supposed to take. And um, 
Jayla and Brie were nice enough to come with me and I'm happy that um, they are coming because it forces me to just push through and do what I have to do because otherwise my temptation would be to just stay here and ultimately cry myself to sleep but, and, and I can't do that because obviously um, it's not healthy for me but also my, I need to do this for my class. I just don't know when I'll finally be able to say that I'm okay and that I'm happy and that and that I'm I'm good and that it's just so hard for right now. It's a confusing time. I don't understand a lot of what's happening. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, what the right thing to do is. For me, what the right thing to do is for this person. <laughs> I just don't know. And it's really hard. <sighs> so I've come out to the site that I wanted to shoot at and as soon as I got here, I was just overwhelmed by how beautiful this view is. I've been here once before, but it was not at this time, and so the sun was already... Actually, the sun was was not close. The sun was out, and right now it's setting, um, so it is just so, so beautiful. And I don't think the camera does any justice to it, because you cannot see the, like, the, the yellows of the... Um, of the sun reflecting off the houses. It's just beautiful. I guess you can kind of see it here. But, wow. This is Perugia. And to the right we have more beautiful views. carrying my camera around like a baby <laughs> um, I just finished shooting like in that area it was really nice um, at a certain point more than the view I started like shooting this little rock crevice thing that had like it was just like a, a stone sort of thing that had a bunch of holes in it and like some parts were yellow some parts were gray and I was playing around with like the settings on the camera with zoom and like a slow shutter speed and it was really freaking cool um, so I'm really excited for this course um, because I think it's gonna get me back into photography a little bit maybe and I'm excited about that only because it's something that I'm now remembering how much I loved and um, yeah so I hope and I also hope that because I'm never gonna give a video because that's like my passion but um, I hope that it, I mean, it definitely will help with like video as well, setting up shots, doing all that sort of thing. And I'm just excited to be back, um, to be back into photography. It was really sort of relaxing and fun and cool. And at certain times I kind of got frustrated with myself because I wanted to just like know all the right techniques. Ciao. <laughs> um, and instead I, I, I didn't know all the right techniques and so it, it's hard because I'm, I'm like really hard on myself and I just want to be perfect at everything like right off the bat but again it's just about learning to be patient with yourself and um, already doing this is a huge step for me because there are so many people that are looking at me like I'm crazy and I don't mind as much as I thought I would but yeah so I'm happy about it my little camera <laughs> yeah by the way if you're squirmish look away but there are so many dead pigeons on the street and like one appears every new, every couple of days. And I don't know why, it's like the street of the cursed pigeons or something. I feel so bad, yeah. Okay, so I'm back now and it's super blue, but I don't know how to change that right now. It's super blue. Also, the background is a disaster. Don't look at that stuff, okay. Do it like this. I have a feeling this is a charger and this is these are the flash drives. I'm really hoping. Let's see. 
Dun, da, da, da. Two flash drives. That means that the other one is a charger. Two flash drives. Um, they're 64 gigabytes each. I wanted a 128 gigabyte one, but it. I realized that the same brand sold um, both like 64 and 128, and 128 was like a couple bucks uh, more expensive than both of these together, which both of these amount to 128 gigabytes, and so I figured I would just buy this. Um, this was, I bought this when I thought that my external hard drive wasn't working, which now it's working, and I figured out what the problem was, so I had it plugged into this little thing down here, into this little outlet, but I sometimes forget that this outlet needs to be plugged into, it has like a long cord attached to it, and that needs to also be plugged into the wall, and so it wasn't plugged in, so when I plugged in my external hard drive, it obviously didn't work, and I was freaking out, <laughs> um, but it's all good now. I think this is my Polaroid charger. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm excited because I have hope that it will solve my Polaroid problems, but it's not guaranteed, so maybe I shouldn't be as excited as I am. I don't know. Oh, oh and it comes with a little thing. Awesome. <laughs> this thing is really big though, like, 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 too big? <gasps> Tell me, no. I know. Well, the first thing I do is drop it. I'm gonna get my Polaroid camera. Is it in here? It is in here, okay. And I'm gonna try to plug it in and see what happens. I really, really, really hope it works. Okay, well, first step, it fits, so that's good. Next, I just undid this by accident. Okay, to put this onto here. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna plug it in, not here, because it's not plugged, or is it plugged in? It might be plugged in. The little button went red, which means that it is charging, or it should be anyway. Yep. Okay, we will wait. By the end of the night, I will definitely come back and check and see what happens to it. Today, Jayla and I found the little Chinese store, um, and since I needed to buy scrunchies, makeup remover, whatever, it was perfect. Um, so I bought toothpaste, um, baking soda. I didn't really want baking soda, but it was the cheapest one, so I just got it. Scrunchies, finally, I like have been dying. I don't have, I lost my one scrunchie somewhere, and then I've been borrowing Jayla scrunchie, and I finally bought scrunchies, so I'm probably gonna lose all of these by the end. Then I bought uh, makeup eye makeup remover. I hope that it works decent because it smells like throw up a little. Never mind, no, it doesn't. A little. I don't. It's like the after smell. Ugh. Okay, well, hopefully it works decent. And then I bought baby wipes because um, they're. This also smells weird. No, never mind. It just smells super babyish. Um, these are, you never know. You, these are useful. And then I also bought some clippies for my hair, which I've been needing. So I bought like a bigger one, which I'm not like too crazy about the shape, to be honest. Um, I hope it like sustains my hair, and I hope that it's decent quality where it doesn't break in two seconds. And then I bought like two smaller ones that seem pretty sturdy. Hopefully, I don't know. Um, and I bought those in black. Uh, so let, let me actually try it out right now. Okay, it, it holds. It holds really well, actually. I'm very pleased with it. Finally, I can do something simple like that to my hair. Wow, okay, cool. That's actually surprisingly good quality. I might go back and pick up some more. Um, I was thinking it was like a small little store. Like it was, it was a pretty big store. It had a lot of stuff, and then it had like an upstairs section that we didn't go to, and it was like home um, necessity stuff. So I guess like appliances, things like that. Um, but it was, it was a cool store. It's a little bit far from here. It's really not. I'm just complaining because it was a whole buttload of stairs that were just killing us. But yeah, no, it was, it was a cute little shop and I definitely think I'll check it out again. I might go back to buy like paint <laughs> um, and like paintbrushes and paper, but I'm not sure. I 
literally just stepped foot into my apartment. Um, I went to Jayla's for dinner and um, I noticed that my camera is green. Um, can you see it? Yeah. So, dun dun dun, dun. moment of truth. I'm honestly very afraid. Before, if I unplugged it, it would just die immediately. So let's see. <gasps> it works! I'm gonna try to take a picture of myself and print it out and hope it works. If it comes out blank again, that just means that it's the actual camera that's malfunctioning as opposed to the battery. But I did do some research and they said that sometimes it comes out blank if it's not charged enough. So I'm hoping that that's the case. Oh my god, I'm so pleased. I'm so happy. <laughs> um, yeah, it came out blue because the correction card never printed, but that's fine. Hey, i rather a blue picture than no picture. I am gonna try to journal right away with this because I'm so happy about it. I think I'm just gonna go to bed now and I am actually gonna clean my room up because it's a disaster again, even though I just cleaned it like two days ago. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow, bye. How do Italians differentiate between a doorbell and a light? I just don't understand. In apartments, I rang this poor guy's doorbell thinking it was a light. And then he came down all in his pajamas. I'm like, I'm so sorry. I thought it was a light. He was like, no, don't worry. It's Sceglie il tuo naso, ogni giorno gli aiutano. <laughs>